Julian Chutzi from Blood and Iron Martial Arts, here to teach you how to deal with aggressive fighters. Before we get started, I'd like to introduce someone new to the show. So sometimes the Coles or I schedule don't quite match up and then we need a stand-in. So without further ado, I present to you the masked assistant. <laughs> First and foremost, the most valuable tool you will ever have in dealing with an aggressive fighter is the ability to circle around aggressively and just having good footwork. So once you understand those mechanics and it looks nice and smooth, it's time to involve the actual sword. So the first fighter we're going to deal with is someone who aggressively charges in for a grapple. They come in and they basically keep binding and look to grab you. So the first step is while they start closing aggressively, you're going to want to spring out to the side and bring the sword up for insurance. If they follow through, you can quickly throw your strike and withdraw or if they keep pushing in with the blade, it gives you something to work off of. This exact same technique works real well if your opponent also delivers real simple, predictable cutting patterns. If your opponent is actually good and they're hyper aggressive while chaining proper attacks, this can be excessively difficult to deal with. The safest option is to aggressively circle while defending and then just withdraw. What's nice about this option is that if you have a good sense of timing and good handwork, you'll probably have time to throw a counter in there somewhere. If you wish to be more productive and get in killing blow right off the bat, an excellent option is to simply interrupt them mid-cycle with a grapple. If you're fighting a good, competent fighter, then sometimes sticking a point in their face is all you need. A great technique for this would be Derv Excellent. So, as you see your opponent start to want to engage, launch your cut, and then simply just disengage their counter. Either this works out well for you because you've got a point right in their face, or it tells them that they can't just charge in like a complete idiot. Well, thank you, Mass Assistant. You can go back to the dungeon. We'll come by to shackle you up in a bit. Something to keep in mind is that there are many, many, many different kinds of aggressive fighters out there. Way too many to fit into one video, so expect more. Something else to keep in mind is that all of these techniques shown really rely on the fact that your opponent has a sense of self-preservation. If your opponent is suicidal or prone to double kills, then a lot of these can just wind up being in double kills. If you're interested in learning more on how to avoid doubles, we did make a video about that, so check that out. Just remember, it all starts with good footwork. If you're not going to put in the training, you're not going to get those results. Interrupt them mid-cycle with a grapple. Oh yeah! <laughs> oh no! <laughs> oh yeah! <laughs>